This is the beginning of a medical procedure called dialysis that a man must do three times a week if he wants to continue living. Like 25,000 other Americans, Irving Endig's kidneys have stopped functioning. If this happened 15 years ago, waste toxins would have accumulated so rapidly in his system, he could not have survived seven days. But now, by using an amazing machine that can detoxify his blood, Irving can live a productive life. Blood is taken from an artery in the leg, passed through a filter, and returned to a vein. The company that makes Irving's machine, Kolb Laboratories, was started in 1964 with a few thousand dollars. In 1967, the SBA guaranteed two key bank loans that enabled Kolb to expand and build a modern plant in Denver, Colorado. Plastic tubing sets which don't clot or damage blood were Kolb's first products, and today, these sets continue to be a major part of its sales. The needle and joints must be perfectly assembled to prevent blood from leaking out or air from leaking into the system. Spearheaded by strong marketing and research, Kolb, in 12 years, has grown to be one of the four major producers of artificial kidney machines in the world. As it did with Kolb, the Small Business Administration has helped to start and expand tens of thousands of American businesses. Kolb's tube sets are assembled and sealed in a sterile room to ensure that patients using them will not become infected. To guarantee this sterility, salt solutions that have been washed through random tube sets are injected into rabbits. If the rabbits develop any fever, indicating that bacteria were present, the whole batch of tubes are re-sterilized and tested again. The heart of the Kolb system is a disposable dialyzer that contains thousands of hollow plastic fibers. Testing them under pressure guarantees there are no leaks. It takes five hours to clean Irving's blood. Blood is a living tissue that must be handled gently and at precise temperature and pressure. If he dialyzes too rapidly, he could go into shock. In 1971, Kolb began building its own dialyzing machine. Using space-age technology to achieve a simpler, more compact design, the Century II has made dialysis accessible to thousands of new patients. Every machine is rigorously tested for a serious malfunction during dialysis can cause shock or death. Quality components, backup systems, and a battery of warning buzzers minimize the chance of accident. To complete its system, Kolb markets its own dialyzing solution. Fundamentally a solution of salt, it washes away the blood's toxins. A new batch must be used for every dialysis. Kolb ships its tubing, machines, and solutions to 44 countries around the world. 50 out of every 1 million people in the world need dialysis to live. Irving Endig feels he is one of the lucky ones. Aided by government grants, he can, with the support of Kolb's kidney machine, remain an active member of society. One day, perhaps, kidney failure will be prevented or cured. But until that day, Kolb's kidney machine will continue to save lives. At 600 colleges and universities across the United States,